Good morning, everyone. Guys, what is going on today? Holy shit, where is my camera? And I hope you guys, I hope you guys, uh, I hope you like what you see out of this demo, man, because I loved it. And I, I, I really, really, really hope that you guys, that you guys also uh, love it, like, real hard. So, are you, are we doing this? Are we doing this? Final Fantasy VII Remake. I just launched. I just launched it. I just pressed a button that launched the Final Fantasy VII Remake. Even if it's not the full game, I just launched it on my own PlayStation. Oh. Select the difficulty of the game. The setting can be changed at any time. This was not an option. Classic is recommended if you want to focus on using commands in battle. So this is uh, the player-controlled character will attack and defend automatically, allowing you to focus on executing commands. Uh, the battle difficulty is the same as easy. Well, we're gonna go with uh, we're gonna go with normal. We're gonna go with normal. How long is the demo? So it's the it's the first uh, Mako. It's the the whole first Mako um, reactor mission annoying that you can't do normal with classic i mean just by how the game is built that totally makes sense that you can't do a normal difficulty with classic because um obviously if your character is automatically attacking and defending then the game is easier just just by default yes virium yes Damn, man. God damn. I've seen this. I don't even know how many times right now. It's quiet for you. Oh, try to turn it up. I've seen this. It's not that quiet now, right? This is the quiet part that you said it was quiet at. That's what I thought. I saw Miles say it's a little quiet. I'm like, I literally can't hear the hear the game myself. So <laughs> I, think, I think it's okay. Oh my jeez Louise, man. Yeah, I'm sure the extended opening is probably the full opening. The one that they the opening movie. Nice. Dude, I've seen this opening so many times now, and every single time I'm like more. Ugh. Get down here, Merc. Flashy for no reason. That's a soldier first class, baby. <laughs> oh, it goes right into. Oh my, jeez, Louise. How? Who goes there? You're up. Here we go, team. You're coming with us. Nice and don't, don't think so. Not bad. Whoa, whoop. Cloud's now level seven. 
So that's uh, that's how seamless the combat is. Can you get a potion from the guard corpse? Uh, well, we just got one. One dropped when we when we beat it. So you can you can break some of the environments. Uh, some of them, some of the boxes you can break, and you'll actually get like uh, mana restoration or health restoration or whatever. Um, we also have a commands menu that you can use right here. And then, okay, so there is no like pause menu. Like you can't do anything else. No, no menu like that. And it doesn't look like I can actually like loot the enemy. It would be really cool if you could. Maybe them dropping a potion is still, you know what I mean? Oh yeah. Who the hell? Hands where I can see him. <sighs> oh, this is so great. Have fun. I love her. I got to meet the cast for the most part, and it was great. ATP gauge fills as time passes, and by attacking with swear, once a bar is full, your character can perform special actions. Charges can be used immediately or saved. Try attacking the enemy to fill the gauge. Freeze! Move and we shoot. Go ahead. You can expend ATB gauge charges to perform battle commands such as using abilities, magic, or items. So I can go spells, fire. He can use magic? Where the hell did he get the materia? Where did he get the materia? I'm a soldier first class, baby. Yeah, so it looks like we actually just got those items, which is pretty cool. I think the nod was still there because when we defeated the enemy, we got a potion. Maybe we, maybe it doesn't drop every time. When not in battle, you can check the map. Open look. Oh, okay, so we can do that. Cool, cool, cool. Move your character close to it automatically. Jump, crouch, or perform whatever other. Okay. From the main menu, you can view your inventory. So this was not the main menu was not available uh, at the demo that I played at PAX. And the demo that I played at PAX did not start here either. It was much smaller. It was like a very, very short thing. Uh, okay, so that's your controller settings. Spells! All we have is fire at the moment. Inventory. Actually, can we... Okay. It's the only one that we have. So this is your equipment uh, menu? Okay. So, like, some stuff you can break. Which is fun. Hello, Zephyrus. Uh, it's the entire the first weapon. Mako reactor. You got this. Yeah, what he said. Dude. You can defend against enemy attacks by pressing R1 to guard or uh, circle to evade. You're coming with us. Nope. They also, I'm noticing they have a, a pressure uh, status. Guessing that just means that whenever they're the direct target of your attacks, they feel the pressure, baby. Nothing over there. Any vending machines? Can I use them? No? Okay. Can I attack them? Just checking. You never know. Open chest or doors or to talk to people. Cool. Can I open the dumpster and climb in like I belong? So these are the chests, which I think really look great. And when they open, they look hot as fuck. I love that animation so much. Uh, I noticed the animation when I played at PAX and I was like, that's actually really nice. Two grenades. The music? Oh, ever. Oh, I'm so excited right now. You find boxes with the Shinra logo. Press square to smash them with your sword. Mako shards that restore MP or potions that restore uh, HP. Like, like, um, like, uh, hang on, they're actually right in front of me. These ones right here. Break those. You'll get a potion or just, um, same with these. These will actually just, you've recovered MP. Like, they immediately do it. You don't have to wait. Is pretty sweet. So what's Soldier Boy's deal? Is he one of us now? He's got balls. This, uh, uh, what was his name again? Cloud. Cloud Strife. Right. And he isn't a soldier anymore. Still, he's a professional, unlike the rest of us. 
I'm glad to have him. <laughs> Dude. This is a one-time gig. When it's done, we're done. Uh, uh, uh. Oh my god, he looks so good. He looks so good. Wow! Real joy to look at, too. Real joy to look at. Jesse said real joy to look at, too. Haha, <laughs> girl, what's up? You'll keep us safe. I'd say you're not even reading the same book. I love how they're done here. Or even the same. Give it a rest. I love that. I love that so much. You can see their conversation happening on the side. That's nice. Come on, nobody do something this crazy just for money. They may not think you're a true believer, but you know what I think? Not interested. <laughs> yeah, dude. Which? Uh, <sighs> you better be worth the money, Merc. Every last gill. Oh, you'll see, dude. You'll see, my guy. I love. They, they did such a good. The cast did such a good job. Wet. I'm wet. Is there anything back over here? I'm me, so I have to just check. You know what I'm saying? I just gotta check. I just gotta check. I just gotta check. Just see it. Just see it. Press R3 to lock onto a specific target. Press R3 again to unlock. While locked on, you can use R or uh, the directional pad to switch between multiple targets. Get him, boy! Oh, guard dog! So I gotta wait for. Oh. So I just switched my op, uh, modes between operator mode and uh... so we got him staggered so we do more damage while an enemy is staggered. So I can switch between uh, punisher mode and operator mode. Operator mode is obviously like a little bit more faster. A little more faster. A little faster. Um, it looks like that was cool. But I like that you can switch those moods. Uh, those uh, moods. Those modes. I'm gonna use magic on the dog here because I think we have some. Yeah, it does way more damage. Then once you stagger the guard dog, it's like, okay, now I can beat up the puppy. Can you pet the dog in Final Fantasy VII Remake? Sort of, yeah. Don't you tell Kaden. Don't you tell Kaden, Amanda. Hi, friends. Hey, Cloud. Elevator's over there. Catch up soon. Don't yell at me, dude. I love them. I love that. I love that. Uh, I, man, I can't wait to see Avalanche have like part of the story. I was actually curious if I could climb up on these. I don't think so. Just checking. Just checking. No, no, no. Okay. Might as well check. Look at his sword. Like, it looks ridiculously good. You can actually see the fire materia slotted in his sword. You see that? That's so cool. God, I love it. Oh. This, this part right here feels like the actual, um, the original game. Potions, some MP, hell yeah. A Moogle medal? I wonder what that is. Grenades, a key item, a medal with a Moogle on it, a popular item among collectors. Oh! Oh! Okay, cool. It's cute. So we also have grenades we can use, which will be fun. Huh. 
Not so fast. We've got company. <laughs> I like how he's like, bye. Look at how good that guard dog looks. Unbelievable. Focus the security officers first, just because. Here's Braver. Brace yourself. Not a limit, just uh, just a normal attack. I switch to Punisher mode. Beautiful. I do have two ATB gauges, so I can I'll show uh focus thrust. Try this. Let's go. Yeah, it's so hot! I'm actually gonna use a potion real quick just because I've been clowning. I've been clowning. Everything. Like the chain on the fence looked like oh my god. You use a potion because I have twelve. I can find. Hey, what's up, guys? Nice. Yeah, it feels great. It feels so good to play. Uh, like, the combat feels super responsive and clean, which is nice. Which is real nice. Wonder how much of that you could have skipped. Like if I could have skipped those two dudes. I don't think so though. Why would you? Come on, Cloud. Wait, I want to talk to Wedge real quick. You say anything? Can I talk to you? No? Alright, well. Okay. go on and catch up with the others. Can you use Punisher mode? Yeah, I just did. Uh so Punisher mode is like this slow, more brutal approach. So you do more. Your attacks are way more like you're just you're sending out everything as much you're literally punishing your enemy. Um and then operator mode, you have you have your abilities and everything that you can use. Soldiers may attack on command, but I hear they make good your guard dogs too. Much faster, Bet much more responsive. Reactors. So how do we get to the bridge above Mako storage? <laughs> Ain't holding out on me, are you? Stamp scared to bite the hand that fed him? Or is he a loyal little doggy? <clears throat> Have it your way, Mutt. We can do this with you, or we can do this without you. Different reactor, different layout. Depends when it was built. Never seen one like this, but I'll manage. Hmm. What's wrong with your head, boy? Don't you worry. Biggs will have the door open soon. Okay, thanks, Jesse. How are how, how you doing? watching you. Big In three, two. Damn, I'm good. Woo! Woo! Who's there? Door! No. no way. It's over! That's my line. Ha <laughs> ha! God, you're badass, dude. Switching modes. Every character has a unique ability, which you can activate with triangle. In this case, Punisher mode. Uh, with Cloud's mode shift ability, you can switch between his balanced operator mode and his attack-oriented Punisher mode. Press triangle to try it out. In Punisher mode, Cloud moves more slowly, but Square unleashes some more powerful attack than usual. In addition, Cloud launches a counter blow every time he guards against an enemy's melee attack. He cannot, however, guard against ranged attacks or magic. When you evade such attacks, you will switch back to operator mode. Okay, cool. We can take him. Make it rain. So I'm gonna wait for them to attack. -hoo -hoo -hoo. Okay. Let's go. I, that was hot. Cut it out. Oh, I enjoyed that. I enjoyed that very what? much. Yes. What are you waiting for? Uh, nothing. I'll go. I'm sorry. Simmer down, hot shot. Simmer down. This is the part where you had to time it. Yeah. It's a good thing I know someone who can get us the passcodes. Pity no one else at command will talk to us, but 
What can you do? Huh. And we're good. I love her. In there. I got this place covered. Like, look at the, the, like, they just make the place actually feel alive. You know what I mean? Like you can see all the workers' lockers and, like, it's, it's great. Security is only going to get tighter, so be ready. We can't afford any more mistakes. Like, like it's it does a really good job of the elevators on another floor. Letting you know you pushing that button that these are these are legitimately eco terrorists, right? Like they're going into people's workplaces and like blowing shit up. So you know Tifa, right? It's sure not do. really my business, but are you guys close? <sighs> Tifa and I Huh. Weird. <clears throat> so there is a soldier first class that you face in this game, Dig. In this, this remake portion. Okay, this is exciting. Hello? These sewer rats appear to call oh themselves Avalanche, sir. We are currently investigating whether they belong to the same group that made the attempt on your life. Rest assured, our inquiries will not take much longer. Did they give him a name already? I this didn't think he had a name. sole purpose is to drain the planet dry. While you sleep, while you eat, while you sit, it's here sucking up Marco. It doesn't rest, and it doesn't care. You do realize what Marco is, don't you? Marco uh, is the lifeblood of our world. The planet bleeds green like you and me bleed red. The hell you think's gonna happen when it's all gone, huh? Answer me! You gonna stand there and pretend you can't hear the planet crying out in pain? I know you can! You really hear that? Damn straight I do. Get help. <laughs> Say that again. <laughs> oh, dude. I'd worry less about the planet and more about the next five seconds. Save the screaming for later. Dude. Our lives are on the line now. You listening, Merc? One false move. And that happens. Well, so much for having Cloud do all the fighting. There are some places a sword just can't reach. <laughs> just bear with him for me, would you? Uh, listen, Jesse. Literally anything you want, I'll do it. That's fine. Should have asked for more money. Do you, uh, do, do you have a source of where they named that soldier and said that he's third, third class? Because I thought that the only thing we knew about him is they said that he was a soldier first class and that we he was a, a new character to the series. But if you can, if you can send me a thing, because I had no idea, and I've been following pretty closely. Okay, cool. Is that is that a source or just the wiki? Barrett specializes in ranged attacks. Holding down square releases a sustained burst of automatic fire when equipped with a ranged weapon. Barrett can fire from safe locations and hit enemies with that Cloud cannot reach with his sword. Gonna throw your sword at him? Let the man with the gun go to work. Oh, yeah, so this is, uh, can't really see, but. So you can, you can, uh, just hold down square and he'll just do it. I want to see what Overcharge does. Oh, that's pretty nice. Press, press triangle while on control of Barrett to deliver a heavy hitting attack that fills a large portion of his ATB gauge. Once unleashed, it takes a long time to recharge. Oh, you can charge it. Okay. I'm just going to use that again. Woo! That's pretty hot. Switch to different characters depending on the battle situation. You can also stick with the same character and issue orders to allied parties. Yeah. Cool. So this is that's the tactical mode. 
Shut up and move over. Hell yeah. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it, Dick. Wow, yeah, I totally missed. I totally missed them ever talking about um, talking about this dude. I thought he was supposed to be uh, first class. Nice, cool. Works for me. I mean, I feel like they're probably gonna figure out that that Cloud's not first class when when they all have to team up to defeat a third class guy but you know it's fine just checking to see if there's anything down here oh this is where we have to go okay hang on first class yeah first class means like stronger better okay i don't think there's anything over here i was just i was just checking you know me shit all right look what we have here the laser security system. Great. Those things will hurt more than your pride if you're careless. They'll cut you down to size and then some. But I'm guessing you've done this kind of thing before. Yeah. Figure out the timing of the lasers. Then make a move when they cycle off. Exactly. I'll go first. Nothing like a little danger to get the blood pumping. Hey! Just keep those baby blues of yours on me. You can move around outside of battle more quickly by holding R1 or R2 to dash. I, yeah, I press just R. L3. I, it was literally just like a little little tiny laser thing. You know, I just ran through. It was no big deal. Not too shabby. I mean, yeah, it's pretty easy peasy, girl. Are you okay? Yeah, I was just seeing if I could get through faster. I was still while still looking for items because I'm me and I I need them all. Even in a demo where it's not important at all, I still need to know. Like I I need to know what what ones there are. Those ones are much faster. See, I was hoping like I you could climb on that stuff, but it's okay. Okay, that was like really fast. Like I started running and it went away as soon as possible. So, you know, whatever, dude. Never really been into any of the Final Fantasies. Are all games completely separate? Yes, all games are completely separate. Unless they're like Final Fantasy X and Final Fantasy X-2. Or Final Fantasy XIII. Oh my, I love... I love the way the sweepers look. Oh man. All right, hang on, hang on. Yeah, look at that. Game sense, man. Game sense. Got to use it. There's a lot of sweepers here, actually. Ah, we can take this hunk of junk. That hunk of junk is a heavy weapons platform. If we rush in, we die. Is that right? We need to hit it with magic. That should give us an opening. I got it. Woo! Just need to fill his gauge a little bit. Hitting enemies with certain attacks or dealing large amounts of damage will temporarily knock them off balance and pressured will appear underneath their gauge. When this happens, pelt them with spells and abilities to quickly fill their stagger gauge under their life bar. Once it's full, you can stagger them. Cool. Hey, just stop moving. Let's pin it down. Give it all you've got. No escape. Don't overdo it. Yeah, I'll do it. I don't think he, okay, he does. So in the other demo, he actually didn't have materia, and they no time to complain. They talked about they actually talked about how uh, how Barrett didn't have any in the demo. Take the lead. Need my help, I'm counting on you. This is gonna stay. Bring it home. I got. Nice. 
dang it! Are defenseless and take more damage. Cool. Now's our chance. Go. Don't need to tell me twice. I'm gonna enjoy this. Woo! That was fun. I don't know. A soldier's rank could be the same as his age. Guess that makes you a one year old. So he knows nothing about soldier. Okay. I love it. Are you guys still going on about that? That's fun. That's cool. That's our target. The Keep reactor that up. core. This whole Gotta Final Fantasy VII thing happening in front of us. But you guys keep you guys keep with what you're doing. You're doing a great job. Yep. <laughs> God damn. I can practically taste the Hurry it up. I can practically taste the man. Dude, delicious. So this alright, so this is the part that uh, I played. So at the the one that I uh, at PAX, you literally started at the top of that ladder and you went down. So this is all this is all something I've played before. Um, yeah, I believe so. Anyways, that's what it seems like. So it's a pretty short, pretty short version of this. All right, thank you so much, Jesse. I love you. I mean, how are you? Okay, you don't need to. That was rude. You know what? Aww, you're choosing me over the reactor? That's sweet, but I'll wait my turn. Go blow her mind. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah. Uh, hell yeah. Beautiful. Cloud's talking about, my point is that uh, Cloud doesn't know how old he is. <laughs> because he doesn't know who he is. Think you know what I'm saying? So you can do an AOE if you hold down square. You actually do like a like an AOE around you. And also you can like hop and attack. So that's pretty cool. Woo! Nice! Ain't no thing. I need to, I need to heal. Oop. Yes, Bean, hello. Yes, I know, Final Fantasy VII, exciting stuff, dude. You think if we fill in, we sink right down to the bottom, to the planet's core. Why is that something that you would, like, actually want to do, though, Merit? I think we'd, uh, just go to the planet core. Because I, I really like the planet, and I wouldn't mind seeing its core. If you know what I mean. That's a that's one six and cool. Woo. Hey, did you see me in action? I missed it. You must have missed it. Oh my god. Are there costumes planned? Like a shirtless cloud one? Oh my god. The thirst though. The thirst. Let's go down this ladder. Can you not slide down them? There we go. R1 to slide down. Ooh, this is a... Yeah, let's do this. Let's do this. This is a big open platform. The reactor right in front of us? I'm sure... Surely nothing is going to happen here. Sh surely. You know? All right. Let's see if Little Stamp really can bite the hand that feeds. Go on. Do the honors. Prove to me you're the man Tifa says you are. That you're one of us. Never said I was. I'm just here for the paycheck. Then do the damn job! John Bentley did such a good job with Barrett. Like, it's great. It's so good. So good. If Dig gets gross, you guys feel free to get rid of him. 
What's up, WoW Nerdstream? I disagree, but uh, they do have a classic. They do have a classic version in this one. I haven't seen it yet, but. What's wrong? I'm fine. What about the timer? Weird. You'll huh? call Merc. Pretty cocky, ain't you? Yeah, a little bit. You can set the timer. That's pretty cool, man. That's uh -huh. pretty cool. You double crossing! <laughs> Heads up. What in the hell? Hell yeah, dude! Hey, how the Scorpion. Hell this it's got reinforced armor. Ah, oh, trying to get out of that. The internals work. can be overloaded. Lightning magic. Okay, no so the hell is this? A target lock. Look out. Woo, try to get out of that. It didn't work. Keep it up. You see the damage I did? So to break his shield, I believe we want to just do. I think we want to do. Um, cast here real quick. Oh shit! Some enemies will occasionally bind your party members with unblockable attacks. If your character is bound, quickly switch to a different character. There. I did. Attack it from the rear. I told you, boy. Oh, that's all you gotta do. Just tag it from the rear, of course, naturally. Gotta get it out of that AOE that he's got there. Those missiles, though. Cause I don't. Hell yeah. I got this. God, I got this. No so good. Another barrier? So he's got a field generator. So I don't remember seeing that actually on the uh Nice. Nice. Ridiculously cool. Oh my god, the whole Watch thing. The All right, so what do we do? We get behind this stuff here. cover behind that debris. Keep it together. Perfect. Take it away. Strike now before it fires again. Out of MP. Braver! Get out of that! Gotta memorize the attack 
how to memorize the attack patterns. Let's go ahead and use... Oh, I think it buffed me out of that. Oops. I mean, it still feels to me like you're you're still selecting some stuff, you know? I'm gonna use a grenade on it. Oh, I think I missed. Heads up, tail laser. I see it. Get behind this. I see it. Hell yeah. Again, though, I think I think what they're saying is that um, easy. If you're playing on a mode like that, it is obviously infinitely easier than this. You know what I mean? Like no matter what, it's just inherent or not infinitely, but it's inherently easier. You know what I'm saying? Been a while since I had to go all out. Oh, getting smacked! Uh, hey, he's doing that thing again. Sure is. <laughs> again and again and again. <laughs> the voice acting, though, I love it so much. It's wide open. Gonna light it up. You got me. So you could issue commands, like just stay controlling one character and issue commands, but. Yeah, they have classic mode for the entire game. Yep. Oh, hey, what's it doing now? An auto repair unit. Damn it. We gotta take it out quick or we're screwed. <laughs> oh, I am way ahead of you, Murph. Calling fire. Get to the, the game ends when all party members reach zero. I'm gonna blow this bastard the hell up, and that's a problem. I'm gonna throw a. a Potion on Cloud here. Bring in the heat. Yeah. Hey, follow my lead. No time to waste. Let's take it out quick. I don't have anything. We'll use Braver. Brace yourself. We made it! That was great. Oh good, it destroyed the reactor for us. Uh oh. <laughs> you hear that? Damn thing showed you how it's done. <laughs> Come on, we've got to move. Oh, good. We still get to play. Good, good, good. Fantastic. I was hoping we'd still be able to play. Shit, the buff! Dude, so that was, that's your first boss fight. And it is, it's it's so good. It's so good. I wish, I, I gotta figure out, I'll play the demo a few more times. I'm sure with with better skill, there's ways of avoiding more damage. Give me a break. I feel like I probably didn't need to fight that guy, but we have time. Oh, can't use the ladder until you kill enemies. Okay. Good to know. Jesse! Oh, no! Girl, I got you. Oh, 
so good. Okay. Okay. Help a girl out, would you? Yeah, let's go. I got you, Jesse. My hero. Hey! Academia. We'll Love the show. So good. Look after Jesse. Come this way. Okay. This route should lead us straight to Barrett. Probably. I'm gonna slide down, so I hope you also slid. I think I see an exit. Come on. Okay, but wait. Just wanna I got another Moogle Moogle medal. I wonder what those are for. Nice. Nice hop. Let's grab his chest. No, 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 I need items. You don't understand. You don't know you don't know me. Can't play can't play a game without getting all the items, you know? <laughs> Shut up and clap. <laughs> okay, Barrett, I'm gonna beat you up there, dude. We're racing. We're racing to the top, dude. We're racing. Okay, that's not fair. Yours was shorter. Shut up, jerk. I would have got there first. But hang on, hang on. Okay, just checking. There's a lot of. Yep. I've got you covered. Find us the way out of here. But then. Don't worry, I'll be fine. I've got Soldier Boy with me. <laughs> Soldier Boy. <clears throat> X Soldier Boy. They're here. Good. Take them down. It's good. Oh, no, cool it. Five seconds is all we need. See ya. Five seconds is all we need. Let's go. The others are waiting. Gotta get the hell out of here, ASAP. Well then let's go, dude. Uh, yeah. Oh, sweeper. Right. Take the lead. Yeah! Out after That's on the high here! Give him hell! Take it over. Pressure. Stagger, kill him, finish him up. Dude, so good. Yes. I like it a lot, is the answer. There's still more sweepers, but I'm sure we'll be fine. Hang on. Foxes! Another Moogle medal! So I have three of those now from doing who knows what. See, if I didn't get that chest before, I would have had to waste time to go get that chest. Now I don't have to, because I got it before, because I'm awesome. So good, man. Soldier boy! Nothing to it. Actually, um, Soldier Boy. Okay. I don't know what, what's what you're saying, but Sol Soldier Boy. I don't even know what that is. We gotta go this way. Are the lasers off? Well, that's handy. Shock Trooper. Oh hell yeah. It's on you. About damn time. Kiss my ass. Dodging everything because he can. So we'll just thunder him. So when enemies are staggered, you can just poop all over. Okay, I was like, is his body gonna go away? It did, it did, it did. You're on your own. That's fine by me. We got two of them. You don't look so good. Take, it from Take care of those wounds before you bleed 
Okay, fire. I bet if we attack from behind, they won't be able to dodge. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I can just Phoenix down him. Got some fight left in you. Here on Cloud. Let's do this. Yes, you're done. This should finish him enough to let's finish this. Okay, just kill him straight up. Sweet. I do have a limit, but we're gonna hold off on that. Show that limits at, show the limit after this. Sure it was. Plenty of time, dude. Sir. Nice phone. Items or anything? Did I already get everything? Is that why? I'm I'm right with you, dude. You stop falling. Can you walk? If I couldn't, believe me, you'd be the first to know. Nice. I'll take that as a yes. Interesting.
Oh, dude. That was great. This, yeah, that was amazing. Nice eyes. Select a version to, to purchase. Uh, can I maybe just select my first class soldier edition? Which is, I'm so excited. I know it's like $400, but it was worth it. Um, that was great. That was great. So that was way more. That was way more than the, uh, the so the demo that you, I played at PAX was literally that point that I said where you go down the ladder and then until you defeat uh, the Sentinel Scorpion, which I think used to be called Guard Scorpion in the original, but it's fine. Um, Sentinel Scorpion or Scorpion Sentinel or whatever in this one. Um, that was great. That was great. That was so cool. Um, so, oh, man, I loved it. 